were just packing but I forgot to show you what we bought so of course macarons at La Durée and also at Sephora I bought a new concealer this one's very thick and covers like crazy so I'm definitely looking forward to using this one and I will be blemish free one particular detail I really really like about the design of the hotel is that you can find books everywhere so this is the breakfast buffet and over here in the lobby slash living room because it looks so cozy you have like this book cupboard with of course, Liberté, Egalité, Fraternité, I love it. Even at the reception, you have all kinds of books. And it just gives it such a cozy feel. I just love it when a hotel manages to combine a really warm, comfy, homey feel with beautiful design. And this hotel has got it all. It's so beautiful. Look at these walls. You can take a picture anywhere here. And it's just... We already checked out, but not before we had an awesome breakfast. French themed breakfast. I have baguette, croissant, fromage, butter, and over here I have a pot of tea and some grapefruit juice. This juice is also so delicious, it's fresh. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Really good start of the day. I love the breakfast at this hotel. Oh, and uh, <laughs> oh, also, we taste some French snacks. Uh oh, is that what you think it is? Yes, it is. That's a ten, the fresh one. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the next snack. It's a lemon tart. Oh, it's our hotel. Ooh. We have to check out. Just okay. okay. One moment, please. Yeah. Now we have to leave. Bye, beautiful room. Bye. This really felt like home away from home. It was so such a cozy room, right? Right. Yeah. <laughs> we have a really nice bed. The beds were yes. really nice. I loved it. But now we're going to see some more sightseeing on our late day in Paris. Paris, oui, oui, mon chéri, come along. Alors, alors. <laughs> oh my gosh. If there are any people from Paris watching, what is up with restaurant Chartier? Or I don't know how you pronounce it. There is a line at this restaurant all the time like last night there was constantly a line today now it's like 12 30 there is a line for this restaurant what is up with restaurant restaurant Charqui? look at this french cuteness these buildings are adorable and we are now going to le sacre coeur basilic le sacre coeur almost there come on church is situated on a hill so you have a fantastic view of Paris I will show you in a moment but the church itself is also very beautiful is there a difference between a church and a basilic I have no idea if there is a difference please explain to me in the comments are you ready for the view are you really really ready are you sure you're ready really really wait I'll give you a proper picture look at this Wow, where's the Eiffel Tower? Can you see the Eiffel Tower? Oh, it's over there, it's over there. Look, between the trees. It's here. Where? Ah, here. The Eiffel Tower is on her head. <laughs> Look at it. Oh, Paris. Paris, what are you doing? Are you seducing us to stay? We want to, we want to. This is why I love the clouds in Amsterdam and also in Paris because it gives you so much better images. <laughs> Look at this. So here, over here we have the rays of sunlight and over there we have like a big ray of sunlight just lighting up this part of the city. Can you see it over here? It's beautiful. Paris, stop, just stop. This is too beautiful, oh my gosh. Like the city is getting this golden glow from the sun. It's gorgeous. Sacre Coeur is over there and we were just walking towards the metro. But I need to show you this cutest candy store ever. Come on, let's look around. This is really, really cute with all kinds of... Bonjour. <laughs> what is it? Oh, um, no, I don't want to shine. Merci. <laughs> but it's 
so cute. Look at it. And they have rose. They have a lot of rose candy. I love that. Thick. Mm -mm -mm. Like all the cute packaging. Look at it. This is perfect for a holiday presents or something. Look at all the colors. Look at it. It's so adorable. I don't even like this candy. I just love the way it looks. And over here we have more cookies and more cute boxes. Look, more cuteness over here and over there. Cuteness here, cuteness there, cuteness everywhere. We are the laziest lunchers ever. So we just walked past by uh, Fred Amanje. So it's it's the French name of a restaurant and Dean has a salad with quinoa and some vegetables and some salmon and I have a pita with falafel and feta cheese. It looks delicious and also I have a mystery drink because I have no idea what's in it. I'm guessing raisin, it's like grapes, something with grapes and fleur, I know it's flour but the rest, I have no idea what this is. Mystery drink tasting. It's very sweet, extremely sweet. I'm guessing it's grape, but it's not very like traditional grape flavor. Mm. It just tastes like lemonade. Okay, I'll roll with it. Next up, Notre Dame. Let's see if we can find Quasimodo. Ringing the bell. So this is the line for the Notre Dame on a Saturday afternoon. It starts somewhere over there and la 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 Yeah, this is not happening. Nadine and I, we we have a different style of making photographs. She just loves to make like touristy pictures and stuff like that. And I very control freakish about people in the photo. I want as little people as possible in my photo. Also, she only wants her own face on the photo and nobody else gets in on the photo. Huh? <laughs> I have the best picture of her with a guy between her legs because she wants so many pe people in her picture. No, that's but not what I said. That's not <laughs> what I said. Look at it. Look at it. Isn't it the most brilliant picture of the Notre Dame you have ever seen? Oh, and there's this guy over here. <laughs> Hashtag evil laugh. <laughs> we're just going to walk around the Notre Dame and see it from all four sides and then we're just going shopping probably again. We'll see. Ooh, so this is Square Jean. And I have no idea what it is because the explanation is only in French. And my French is only like, merci, au revoir, la la la. Not, not like for reading stories, but this looks amazing i've never seen the notre dame from the back wow doesn't it look a little bit like hogwarts or maybe hogwarts was modeled after it it's very beautiful i love this window here the round window this is really quite a good alternative so if you know that this is not going to be your last time in paris like we know because we live in amsterdam you know it's like maybe yeah it's seven hours by bus so it's fine uh yeah i would definitely recommend to just walk around the Notre Dame if you don't feel like standing in line. Also, maybe it's a good idea to not go to Notre Dame on a Saturday or a Sunday. Just go on a weekday, if you can. Listen! Whoop whoop! We were supposed to come back at night, but you know, we have shopping to do. Rue de Rifoli, the high street shopping street in Paris. We have some shopping to do for Nadine's daughters, but look at this decoration, it's so cute! Ho ho ho, almost Christmas! Whoops, didn't plan on shopping, but you know, the most fun happens when you don't make plans. Seriously, what is up with this restaurant? Look at this line, and it's now it's a double line, so you have the first layer here, and there's a layer of people over there, it's insane. So if you want a popular restaurant in Paris, uh, it's a restaurant, restaurant Chartier. Wow, we actually made it to a restaurant. Small restaurant. It's Indiana Cafe, and we have an awesome view because we're sitting at the window. And the reason why we wanted to eat here is because they have a lot of vegetarian options. Look at this: veggie salad, veggie burger, bagel, vegetarian enchiladas, tacos. Oh my gosh! I almost took like the veggie burger it's with a quinoa patty but last minute 
I thought, let me be healthy because I've been eating so much junk these past weeks, these past days, and the quinoa burger looks so good. The veggie burger, and look at the fries, the golden crispy brown, everything. But the salad looks good too. It's like it's with a mint dressing. It's a quinoa salad and lots of fresh veggies. We're back at our home away from home, and we have an hour to kill before we have to go to the bus stop again. This is why I call it home away from home because they have an open bar. They can take such good care of their guests. Like over here, you can just grab a drink if you want. They have tea, they have coffee, um, snacks. Look at this. Look at this. Here, here are chocolate brownies and stuff like that. It's such a pleasure to stay here. What? I just discovered these jars of sweets and over here you have uh, like pie and like <laughs> granola what is this wow it's already time our flix bus is waiting for us and um we're going back to amsterdam mm, yeah and you should always shoot for the stars never compromise baby so this is going in with raspberries and a rose flavored something and it's just like 